We're doing an unpacking. This is a print from England. It is a Julian Trevelyan print. It's titled Richmond Park. There is one called Richmond Gardens, which is very, very similar, but not, but not the same. It's similar in that it uses the same colours. So this is number 54, limited edition print of 75. So it's a modest run. When you get into 500 or 2000, I always question whether it's that, that limited. We put a black veil on this one. <clears throat> We've got a number of them. Some of them are in gold frames, some are in white frames. Some have got a that we've done with the graphite background. So this one is titled Richmond Park. It is signed in pencil by Julian Trevelyan, full signature, not just initials, numbered 5475 in pencil as well. So they put this in a box frame. <clears throat> they put it in a box frame and the print is not a touch in the glass, it's sunken, yet the print is not on the back either, it's sort of in the middle, you, you get the shade. You can see the whole print, the cut edge, it's an artisan print. You can see the impression where the colour's been pushed in and you've got a park. So you have trees, obviously, deer, dog, man, woman, horse riders or riders, a crowd, a load of dogs. That's what it's like, that's what it's like. The bit there is probably unknown, unknown grass, or possibly water, I don't know. Uh, these are stags, there's two stags. Um, <clears throat> it's really good. The, the, thing, the thing here I notice is the bottom of the trees is flat. And if you go to Richmond Park and you go look at the trees, you'll, you'll notice there's no branches at all under this height because the sheep and the deer eat all the vegetation on the tree up to a certain height, as far as they can reach. So these trees obviously are growing all over the place, but there's always a line at the bottom, which is straight. So he's got that, so I think is good. I think that that works very well. You've got black on the fr frame, black in the print. It's a lovely thing. Okay, thank you.